you are weak. At the young age of 10, Valkia fought her first battle. Not long after she killed for the first time. Life as a Norskin is not easy, nor is it pleasant. Valkia, the daughter of a chieftain, thrived in the cold, merciless culture she was born into, always itching for the next fight. As her father grew sick, weak, both in body and soul, so did the tribe slowly. No one, however, stood up to him, save for his eldest daughter, Valkia. A day came where a fleeing people came to beg for succor and protection at their door. It is tradition and wise to accept the women and kill the men, for a tribe needs many women to bear many warriors. Chieftain Merak, Valkia's father, however, in his age and softness saw worth in adding farmers to their group and offered all a place in his camp. The tribe watched as their leader, so weak in will, was no longer willing to do what was expected, needed of him. Lil Ven, you are weak. Valkia slaughters the men. The chieftain dead, Valkia takes control of the Schwarzwolf, leading them once more into battle. They grow strong again, more feared like never before. An offer you can't refuse. Valkia is vicious, gruesome, and strong. She earns the name Gore Queen. A name like that is earned. And the demon prince Lucifex took notice of the young and beautiful Gore Queen. He makes his way to her great hall and offers what none would ever deny, a place at his side. You dare imply that I am destined to be nothing more than a slave girl? To cater to your lusts and whims for an eternity? Death is preferable by far. A challenge for a death match is issued, and the two fight for two days. At the end, Losefect lies dead at Valkia's feet. The Gore Queen dedicates his death to Karna and swears to deliver Losefect's head to his shrine deep within the chaos wastes. The end of the beginning. Valkia marches forth, Losefect's head strapped to her shield. The way is long and treacherous. She is attacked and ambushed repeatedly along the way, yet she stands strong. Fight after fight, little rest for her gore queen. Deep in the chaos waste, her strength begins to wane, and eventually the endless attacks grind her down and she is killed. They say that the Axe Father watched her and wasn't ready to let such a mighty warrior die just yet. He took her corpse and breathed new life into it, burning in his glory. She was forged anew, wings torn from the flesh of her back, cloven feet for sure footing pulled from her legs. Valkia the Gore Queen, bringer of glory, sword maiden of the blood god has risen.